Hello everyone, Trigon here, and we are back in Subnautica. So, let's see. In our last episode, we got our uh, battery charger right here. You can see it's busily uh, almost done charging batteries. Got 1% on that one. Cool. And I did make a couple more batteries, so we've got two spare batteries in here. So, we're in good shape on batteries. I also made the... Uh, um, power cell charger and stuck it there so we can charge the power cells for the uh, for the Seamoth. Uh, let's see, med kits. Let's put that one away and then we'll grab the next one out of here. Probably stocked up enough med kits. I probably don't need to keep pulling them out of there. So yeah, we've got med kits to go uh, to spare. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and grab another one. We'll take two. So I don't know what we're going to run into. So, um, I think the next thing we need to do is we need to get this base built up, which means we need access to, like, the general purpose room and things like that. So, oh good, our power cell is charged. Let's take our power cell, and let's head out and try to find the island. The power cell in back here. There we go. Let me hop in. And we'll go ahead and surface. Oh, it is so nice having this guy here. Oh, I really needed some food, didn't I? Well, we will survive until I get back. Okay, so that's there. So that looks like that should be the island right there. So let's go. <clears throat> Put the headlight on or off? That lag, lag, it was off. Or was it on? I don't know. It's on now. It's a little deeper. I want to check out what's down here while we're going this way. Oh, look at all those great big huge crystal deposits. Looks like quite a cliff here. Oh man, all the lag. That's... Wow, why is it so laggy? I'm sorry about the lag, folks. I don't know what's causing that. I don't know what's with the weird green light, either. That's really strange. I'm going to head up to the surface. I think it's laggy because we're resing in a lot of stuff. I think that's the island right there. I think I can see it. Sure enough. Boy, does it look basic from this distance. Wow. Uh, I'm hearing sounds I don't like. I don't know about you. Okay. Well, this certainly looks inhospitable, doesn't it? What is with the green glow? What is this radioactive water over on the side? What's that? Okay, there we go. Thought there was a beach spot that you could get up onto. I have discovered it is very, very possible to get your sea moth stuck. <laughs> so I'm going to be very careful about how far up I go. Alright, we'll leave it right there. Wow, look at all that. Everything is that direction. Let's get our knife out. Oh, let's turn the headlights out. I don't know if it'll make any difference, but I don't want to risk coming back to a dead battery. Okay, knife out. So, I'm sure you could, well, you could see one right there. See, there's a structure right up there. If we can get up there and scan that structure, then it'll be, I hope, something we can then... Energy signatures. Some of the stuff here. Oh, let's get the scanner out. Jaffa cup. I don't know what a Jaffa cup is. Looks interesting. Can't pick it up, whatever it is. Voxel shrub. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. Keep scanning now. Another thing I know that the silent have is like edible plants. And if we can get our base built up where we can uh, to a point where we can uh, get some planters in, even if they're just small planters. It means we could grow food. And 
that would be one heck of an improvement in my book. Okay, there's that. Looks like we can get up to it from over here. What's this? It's not something... Now, when I played this game before, there was nothing... I don't think there was anything dangerous on the island, but it has been a while since we played. So, uh, you know, it's entirely possible that that we're walking into trouble here. Or hopping into trouble. Ugh. Come on. I can't get up there, can I? Alright, well, we gotta try a different route, I guess. There's a little... Oh, is this... <coughs> I think that's... Oh, this is not going to be fun. Oof. Okay, yeah. So yeah, this is called the floating island. I thought that's what it was. Because, well, it's floating. Oh, come on. Is there no way out of here? Did I just fall to my doom here? Oh dear. Oh, uh, there's a cave. I found a beach at least, just so we can walk here. But yeah, I do believe it looks to me like there's no way out of here. We slip down here and... Is there a way to climb up over there? I think there is. Let's swim back up over there. Yeah, right here. We can climb up right here. So we can climb that direction, too. Okay. I feel much better about that now. Okay, so, important safety tip. Don't fall down there. Now we're even further from that, though. I was trying to get up there. So we could scan the structures. I guess we might as well just keep going here. These look interesting. What's this? Ming plant. I guess because it looks like a Ming vase. <laughs> hey, now it's playing tense music. I don't like this. Uh, oop, oh, here's something else. Speckled Rattler? Uh, I hope it doesn't bite. I can pick it up. Oh, oh, hey, there's something to take back with us. I don't know if it'll spoil before we get back, but... Grub Basket. Okay. <laughs> my nose is itching. <clears throat> I shall do my best to avoid sneezing in, in, in your ear. There's another structure up there and a weird world geometry that doesn't fit. No, no, we're not going to do that falling off the cliff thing again. Oh, nah. Oh, come on, up, 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 there we go. All right. There probably was an easier way up here, but, oh, you know. Whatever works. I feel like I'm crouched or something. Is this the one we saw earlier, or is this a different one? I think this is the one we were looking at earlier. We've, we've come all the way around. We're coming at it from a different angle now, which is sort of what I was trying to do before falling into the pit. And there's another one over on the other hilltop over there. Boy, that's precariously placed. What idiot built their survival shelter huh? on a place like that? 
Up we go, up we go. I'm gonna switch back. Switch back, switch back, and more switch back. Oh no, is the sun going down? I'm gonna be stuck here in the dark. And I never made myself a flashlight either. Yep, nighttime approaches. The bulkhead. Cool. Didn't even know I didn't know a bulkhead or any of that sort of thing. Need blueprint acquired. I some water. At least we won't run out of water. That's reinforced there. What else we got? Fern palm. Indoor grow bed. Okay, excellent. That will allow us to grow things if we can find a room big enough to place them. I wonder if they can be placed in a hallway. You know, in other connecting corners. Lantern tree. Okay, we can make it now. That's good. Definitely helped with our food situation some. Inventory full. Warning. Blood loss detected. Whoa! Okay, don't eat too many of those. I'm gonna take one of them for let's use the flashlight on this thing hopefully it won't burn up the battery yeah. observatory, oh good, good well great, if they can put a planter in an observatory, so can we You know, this looks like it's been here for a long time. Was I in... Oh, I wasn't in stasis. I was in stasis. I was just on a... What you call it? Did we deconstruct any of this stuff? I don't think so. I suppose it wouldn't really help us anyways. Do much till the sun comes up. <clears throat> so, yeah, I don't know not to eat too many of those things, the lantern fruits. Why did we lose blood? It doesn't say anything about losing blood from those things. Oh wow, just having this thing out is burning power. Look at that. We've lost 3% of the battery power just from having the thing out. Huh? Using its flashlight. Had another percent right there. Okay, it has to get put away. I can't keep wasting it that way. Wait a minute, there's... Oh, what's this? Integrating new PDA data. There we go. The Gassy survivors.
Uh, okay. Sounds like we're not alone on this planet. Okay. Interesting. Not exactly something I wanted to hear at this point, but, you know, that's a long way down. Okay, let's very, very carefully make our way back the way we came, right? Right? We can do this without falling to our death, right? We hope. No, don't run. Don't run. Just, just walk. Ah. Oh, here's some more ruins over here. At least I'm using the term ruins right this time. These are definitely ruins. Oh, hot dog. Multi-purpose room. That's what I wanted. You know, the multi-purpose room. Yeah, we got the blueprint for just one scan. Exterior grow bed. Nice. With the, uh... Ooh, Chinese potato plant. Water, a marble melon plant. Okay, so we have one of each plant. Hopefully... And get them back, and then we'll be able to uh... integrate new DDA data. Huh. Interesting. Uh, sorry, maybe I should have actually been saying something, but I was reading. Living wall. What does a living wall do? Purely decorative, okay, well. Now we know it does nothing. Spotlight. Here to the other side. Look, see, to see what we've got. Can we open that. Can we get in through there? I don't think so. Oh, come on. I'm stuck in stuff. Huh? Don't think we can go up there either. That's just the other side of that room.
first aid kit at least. Not that we need it, but. Okay, let's go down in here and see what's at the bottom here. The PDA. Integrating new PDA data. So this is from a different ship. No wonder these look like they've been here so long. and built this habitat from the scrap. Hmm, question using digi training and foreign technology. Anything about this being a rescue mission? Oh, battery. I don't see anything else in here. Do you? It's some very valuable uh, blueprints. Some grow beds. Or our plants doing? You know, I'm starting to feel that maybe it would be wise to get what we've got back to the uh, back to our base. Get some grow beds made. Oh, I want to get up there to that one though. Let's see if we can get up to that one and then head home. This way. Yeah, there's a trail of some sort going up this way. We have a tunnel through here. Scary. Oh, why do I keep... Okay. Did I... Was it a mistake coming to this? Oh, maybe this goes up a little bit? I think maybe it does. Give us a better angle on this. Slowly we make our way up. Nope, 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 nope. Do not fall off there. No. Ugh. Oh, there we go. Okay, now we're up. Why on earth did they build so high up here? Were they afraid the island was going to sink or something? Actually, this is a floating island. <laughs> Maybe... Maybe they were justified in thinking the island was going to sink, but I don't think uh, if the whole if the island isn't connected to the, the ground, I don't think uh, building on the hilltop is going to help. Uh, uh, oh God, that was 
Gary with that right behind us. Don't need another speckled rattler. I don't need any of that stuff. There's the habitat right there. Come on. Come on. There we go. All right, we made it up here. There's any place to go but inside. Oh. All right, plant pots. These are real handy. I remember using these uh, my first game. Uh, I'd plant the potatoes in them. And that gave us food. New blueprint acquired. This is more potatoes. But these PDAs definitely weren't here last time. Integrating new PDA data. I don't see anything else here. Just this interesting design choice here. But that was definitely worth our time. Is there anything else in here? I don't see anything else. Okay. Let's take a look at this real quick. That's one I already read. Already read that one too. Oh, okay. We're gonna get into that later. Right now, I wanna whoa, not fall on my doom. Not falling in my doom is one of those things I've always wanted to do. Okay. Alright, I am going to make uh, my way back down to our mini sub, which is clear over on the other side of the island, and head back to base. But that is it for today. We are definitely out of time. Um, so hopefully, when, uh, when we come back, I will be safely home and we can start building some of this stuff. So that's it. If you enjoyed the video, please smash that uh, like button and please subscribe if you've not done so already. And uh, thank you for watching.